No, this shouldn't be. Okay. <laughs> Volunteer. Volunteer. Yes. I have to wear this? Yes. All right. You have it. Okay. You can start describing us what you're seeing. I see a lot of eyeballs floating around. Uh, Homer Simpson with a weird head. Some sort of a kaleidoscope thingy? Does it change when I close my... I don't really understand it again. I think, I think it is probably I am in some space and the space has borders and the items are floating outside of that space and then I cannot see them anymore. It looks mm -hmm. like clipping, clipping of uh, items at um, uh, <laughs> Buckminster Fuller sphere in which I am locked <laughs> in here. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> It's so nice, I don't want to leave it anymore. Can I stay in this <laughs> alternative oh, universe? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, we're showing. Okay. Um, wait, wait a second. Do you no. think you understand quantum mechanics now? No. <laughs> That's actually the correct answer. <laughs> because actually, as Richard Feynman yeah. says, I actually think no one understands quantum mechanics. <laughs> but we still gave it a try. Yeah. Well, uh, first of all, we, we met. Like, we're going back in time now a little bit because we had actually no idea. Uh, like, just this rough idea of combining virtual reality with uh, quantum mechanics. And yeah, Jana, me, Philip, Julia, and Benjamin, we met and worked on that. And the challenge was, right, as I just said, to combine quantum rea um, mechanics with VR. So, um, not everybody had the same uh, level of not understanding in our team, so we made some brainstorming, and uh, then we kind of um, yeah, concentrated on this part, on the observing. So, um, we have like a game with different orbits in the end, that was the idea. If you catch an object, and then all the other possible um, States uh, disappear. Um, yeah, we have a better picture for that. So we have instead of uh, particles like protons or electrons, we we have weird objects from the reality and 3D virtual reality. And yeah, um, yeah uh, this is a hydrogen atom, so we made a visualization of this, and it's the simplest atom as you can see. So you see the probability density there. In 2D, um, and on the next page, uh, you see on the left side we uh, made a 3D model uh, of the surface to visualize, and you see the Schrodinger equation describing all the probabilities. Yeah, the last one.